Trouble is far from over for the world's top tennis player after Novak Djokovic was banned from the Australian Open. The next major tournament is the French Open, and tonight there's word that he may be banned from that competition too. The reason? He's not vaccinated. And that could also mean he can't play here at the U.S. Open. CBS's Charlie Daggett reports. The smashes, double faults, and backhands played out on the court this time as the Australian Open got underway. The show went on despite booting out its nine-time winner and defending champion. Djokovic is sitting this one out in his native Serbia, where supporters, including the Serb president, accused the Australian government of a political witch hunt against the world number one. It's not Novak that is humiliated. I think Australian, Australian authorities humiliated themselves. Those Australian authorities detained and ultimately deported the star over a visa battle that focused largely on the fact he was unvaccinated. In a statement, Djokovic said he was extremely disappointed in the court's decision to revoke his visa. I hope that we can all now focus on the game and tournament I love. Defending her own title after a four-month break to look after her mental health, Naomi Osaka, not allowing the Djokovic saga to overshadow the tournament. Even before this whole situation, um, my goal for this year is just to like focus on myself. Focus that's worked, nailing her first match in straight sets. As for Djokovic competing in the French Open in May, the sports minister said the situation may change, but at the moment, there's no exception to the rule that all athletes must be vaccinated in order to compete. Nora? Charlie Daggett, thanks.